Hey guys, just finished up first day of prep. Crazy workout. And also a new Zephyr dropping uh, Thursday. Where's it at? Yeah, right here. Get your new uh, Tempest tag. We got it in gold, black, and silver. But yeah, link in description. Link in description. Link in description. Uh, just killed. Just killed this workout, man. First day of prep. Just wait for the competitor series, guys. Uh, yeah, I can't wait to. Can't wait for you guys. Just comment down below when you see it. What's up guys? Good morning. Welcome to episode 2. As you see I slipped on the scale 168.4. <laughs> so you guys 164. But uh, there has been a little bit of water weight from the past couple days and that's strictly because I've been just stuffing my face um, up until you know the last couple days. And so 168.4 is what the scale says. I haven't used the restroom yet, so maybe that's also a little factor too. So I would say around like 167, 166 is where I'm at. So it's been around seven months since I've touched this thing, but um, gotta get back on track, guys. So going to this cut, um, I wanna say like, since I haven't tracked macros in a little over seven months, I don't know exactly where I'm at. Um, I would definitely say that this cut, my fat has been a lot higher, my fat intake, which is a good thing because essentially like from every single prep, I've always cut on lower fats and that's just because of how my body reacts to fats. So my macros for this cut are gonna be a little different. I'm gonna start off with 70 grams of fat 275 carbs and 160 protein. So that is the macros for the first week. Now, these macros are strictly tester macros. My weight may fluctuate. Um, I would definitely say that my weight will probably go down just a tad bit, uh, just because it's more of a consistent intake every single day. Okay, so breakfast is the same. You probably already see this pretty often. I just have uh, two servings of Fruit Loops, got some milk, and got some egg whites with Maggie soy sauce. Obviously you see this breakfast quite often and that's strictly just because like I don't really like to um, switch things up too much, especially in the beginning. Um, even when I'm tracking macros, obviously. Just simply for the fact because like the only thing that really changes is uh, obviously the volume. And um, I enjoy eating these foods. So I'm gonna stick to eating these foods and if my macros fit, obviously I will be eating them. So. That is the beauty of flexible dieting. I thought I was playing with these Rice Krispies, huh? <laughs> Boy! Mm -mm. Any issues with that? Middle back tight. Middle back tight. That same area? Yeah. T yeah, tight. Tighter? Yeah. Okay, same area. Okay. So it's tight. Did okay? Yeah. Just got finished with my buddy Jordan over at Arosti. Wow, guys. So I've been coming to Arosti like pretty much every week. Um, he's been working on me and trying to fix um, my problem, which is a prognosis of a chronic strain in my hip flexors and stuff like that. That's what he said. And uh, wow, guys. So therapeutic. Can you tell? Like, he was working on my back and I fell asleep. I, I literally fell asleep for like 20 minutes. <laughs> so. Really, really good session. Um, if you're in the area, come check out Arosti. You might be seeing me do some work with Arosti pretty soon, possibly. I'll be on the lookout for that. Um, but yeah, super excited um, that he's helping me and giving me this opportunity, and so is Arosti, and uh, definitely fixing me, that's for sure. So if you're in the Sugarland area, come check them out. Look for my man Jordan. He works at the Alpha Lee Gym, so check him out. Yeah, 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 yeah
What's up guys welcome to the commentary and my full physique update guys so this is how i am currently looking um so i i put two side by side comparisons and that's strictly because the first comparison on the left is from 2016 when um, i was about 27 weeks out and the one on the right is my current physique um, so i would definitely say that my current physique on the left hand side is my um physique when I was about 172 pounds, 171 pounds, and the one on the right, which is current, um, is I am 168 as of uh, today, and uh, I did this because I wanted to show you guys a little bit of growth um, and how difficult, how minute the changes are in natural bodybuilding. So um, in 2016, I've been lifting for about close to eight years, and now it's close to about nine and a half to ten years and um, I see very very minor um, size gains if not it's honestly not that much and obviously these are just size comparisons that I'm able to see the most I think that what I've brought up the most is my arms and my quads uh, my hamstrings seem to be on it's just a little bit smaller um, and uh, you'll see in a little bit you know, this from this shot, you can tell that my quads are definitely bigger. Um, hamstrings felt like they just look a little bit smaller. It's kind of weird. Um, and you'll see from these shots right here, guys, my hamstrings are definitely not as big, um, which is kind of weird. Um, but one thing that has definitely grown, guys, is my back. Look at the huge difference. I'm wider, I'm thicker, my shoulders are bigger, and my arms are definitely bigger calves are definitely the same <laughs> but um you guys let me know how you're how i'm looking right now um you know there's a difference of three to four pounds in this video but as you can tell like i've put on a pretty substantial amount of muscle and that's how that's how difficult natural bodybuilding is guys like it, it's it's a little bit harder to put on muscle and uh yeah that's pretty much the physique update and how i'm looking as of start 12 weeks to diet down Hope you all enjoyed this little physique update. Um, let me all let me know what you all think about everything. Please don't forget to like, comment, share, subscribe, and um, I will see you guys in the next video. Thank you for watching. Peace out. Wow, I am officially out of posing shape, <laughs> guys. I seriously thought that I still had it. I still like having my posing down. Wow, after doing that, and that was just a very, very quick session. I am definitely out of shape. Hope you all enjoyed this little video. Uh, hope you all enjoyed the workout, um, the posing update. If you did, please like, comment, share, subscribe, and throw some feedback in there for my posing. I know it needs some work, it's a little bit rusty. I promise it'll get better. And uh, let me know how my current shape is. Um, and yeah, guys. That's the end of that. Thanks for watching. See you guys in the next video. Peace out.